Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell you two point load on a beam in a stat pro. How to add two point load in a stat pro? Two point load uh, loading in a um, simply supported beam or any other beam. You, you have to simply uh, understand what I am telling. See here you can see two point load being applied over a simply supported beam where two ends are fixed. Now we will simply simulate these things into the uh, stat pro so before that we have to open the stat pro as run as administrator so that all features will work in a correct way after that we are selecting new project space suppose we are named as simply supported beam with Two point load meter and kilonewton. Next, add beam. Suppose I am creating one column along with another. Here you can see my frame. After that, we are simply go to general and we will define the material as rectangle material having 0 0.32 0 0.5 you can uh, simply check or uncheck this one uh, if you uncheck this one you have to you have to go to material box and and again have to add the material in that way so better to click this one so that you can simply um, have all the detailed material as you want after that we have clicked all the things we are also defining one circle circular um, uh, material for column purpose suppose in rectangle we are only assigning this one as rectangle 0 0.3 to 0 0.5 okay after that if we have to click all these two columns having a circular diameter then we can simply click this one by pressing control and have to click make sure by clicking this one your uh, circular option also have to be click after that click and after that go to support have to go uh, create support fix support have to add and after that uh, clicking the support option we are simply go to front view then you can simply drag down all those nodes support to assign ok our uh, both ends are fixed support right now after that if we are, we are adding you can simply check the dimensions actually for that you can simply see here here we can see our beam length is 7 meter and column length is 4 meter so if we have to remove this one simply have to click and remove after that have to go load load case details add right now I am not adding any dead load like self weight and all I am just simply showing the two methods okay so load case one add load case add have to go number load concentrated force uh, one is minus 5 having 3 meter and 0 add and another one is minus 6 having uh, our ending point is like 5 and our starting point is 3 then I have to click 3 ok now if we apply both these things no we are only applying this one so I have to click this assign to selected beam assign ok and then also click this one assign to selected beam you can see both the um, B, both the uh, loads been applied separately ok you can see an isometric view that's it for today uh, 
gives us thumbs up and uh, keep visiting our channel thank you